All right, y'all, back with another sports talk. I'm Xander. I'm Colton. And we're gonna be talking all things sports. Off with HN Sports first, going to football. Corbin, how did football do this week? Oh, um, I think we played a really good game for homecoming week, and it was really fun. What was the final score? Was it 52-14? That would be correct. Coming back from a huge loss against the Redmond Cooper's. We needed to come back win. And this week, we got the Upper Soda Valley Rams. It's going to be a tough game, but I think the others can get it done. And that game is for the conference championship. And after that, we beat USB. All we got to do is beat LG. And then we win it. What are some highlights of that game, you reckon? Um, a lot of pancake blocks from Big Mike. Yep. Here. New addition, Big Mike. I think he got, like, what, two sacks? Yep. Um... Yep, a lot of yep. touchdowns, a lot of touchdowns. Nolan Hobson, key player in that game, four touchdowns, a whole lot of carries and a whole lot of yards. And then the defense, for an outstanding game, let up two touchdowns against Crestline, which you can't do. But sometimes you gotta do it. Had a pretty good one. They're now co-league champions. Uh, Xander, how do you feel about that game? You know, it was quite the, it was quite the nail biter that whole game. First set didn't get it done. Next three sets, we really took it to them. That first set was just, we weren't there. You know, we wanted four, wanted four, and we got it done. That's what matters the most. We get to, it's a share. Nobody ever sees it's a share, so that's all that matters. It was a good game. That final set was really exciting, really electric. Good game from the girls. Love it. Just love it. Years, we have cross country. Xander, how do you feel about cross country? Um, the cross country, they're the champions. That's all I'm going to say. I know I had some, we had some top performers up there. We got Riley, we got Tracy, we got Andrew. Loose to the quarter, but I know they were the top dogs up there. Great runs from the boys. Shout out to Ann, she's the only cross country girls member. <laughs> so, congrats for sticking through the season. That's awesome. But special congrats to the boys for winning that championship. We got two championships now out of three fall sports. So we're gonna, football's gonna get it done. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's shift to a new topic here. We're going to talk about Ohio State football. Ohio State football, it was a good game for the whole game. You know, it was back and forth, back and forth. Final score, 31, 32. And Ohio State just didn't get it done. You can't slide with zero seconds left on the clock. You got to get some time to call a timeout. That's my thoughts. Cool, you got any thoughts about that game? Um, you know, I'm not the biggest Ohio State fan, but it was a good fight. And they just couldn't get it done. We have to get it done next time. You know this new this new twelve man playoff though. Anybody can make it, even Notre Dame. So we're gonna move it up a level, and we're gonna go to the NFL. So our higher teams we had the Browns who played the Eagles, and we had the Bengals who played the New York Giants. The Browns had a tragic loss, another tragic loss, sixteen to twenty, and the Sean Watson. It's not getting it done with the offense. Defense is there, holding the Eagles 20 points is not bad. But the offense is just not there. Corbin, what was the score of the Bengals game? How'd that uh, game go? 17-7, to 7, Bengals won. Joe Burrow, he had that run. He looked really fast. And the safety, where were you? Man, what was the safety doing? That's all we got to say about that one. We're going to give a special shout-out, or I guess a non-shout-out, to the Dallas Cowboys. My home team, the team I love. That was <laughs> awful. That was pure awful. All right, this week, following week, we got, who we got, Corbin? Football. Oh, USB. We got the Upper City Valley Rams. I already mentioned that. We're going to mention him because it's such a big game. I want to see you out there supporting, cheering on the Bears. Marching band, do your thing. Cheer, do your thing. Students, they can do your thing. The football's going to do our thing. We're going to get it done. Home game, 7 o'clock, Friday. Be there. Also, we got Elgin the next following week at Elgin, 7 o'clock. Be there. And then, volleyball this Thursday. Where they at, Corey? Oh. New Knoxville. Right? Yeah. New they play at New Knoxville against Ada at 7.30. So we're going to come out and support. We're going to show them that we really care about them. We really love the team. And we're going to beat Ada. And we're going to keep moving on. So I would say, you got anything else you want to talk about in sports? Oh, just make sure everyone's there Friday. It's a big game, like yep. you said. The um, game. That's all. Yep. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. This was another sports talk. We love to see it. Peace. Go Raiders.
Thank <laughs> you.